just wanted to take you through basics of superposition and uh, quantum entanglement on the spin cube Gemini mini quantum computer. Ah, it's a laptop quantum computer today. Okay, first, for a superposition, and that is a qubit is in both states almost simultaneously. It's zero and one at once, but it's some probability between zero and one based upon the position, the spin of the molecules. So in order to put a qubit into a state of superposition, we apply the Hadamard gate Run that. So now we can see projection probability of being in a zero state or a one state are equal at 0.5. This is the block sphere which shows the actual spin of the electrons. You can see the x, y, and z plane. On the z-plane, being at the top, oriented toward the top, is a zero in terms of bit value. And with the spin going down to negative z, that's equivalent to a one. That's superposition. Now to entangle two qubits together, first we need two qubits, and that is simply a matter of applying the C knot gate or control the knot. Where there's a target qubit, qubit one in this case, and a control qubit that determines whether or not the knot is executed. So we select qubit zero as the control qubit. Now I run that task. Results. And that is fairly equivalent superposition of the zero zero state in the one one state of both qubits. It's also known as the Bell state and used, is used as a starting point. So, superposition and entanglement for many quantum algorithms. Just wanted to share a very particularly interesting result of an experiment of a circuit that I've been working on. So let's go to the tasks. Okay. This starts out with a Hadamard gate on qubit one to achieve the state of superposition. That is uh, tip zero plus ket1 over the square root of 2. So qubit 1 is in superposition at this point. Qubit, qubit 0 is in superposition at this point. In the second phase, I used a controlled knot gate to copy the superposition state of qubit 0 to qubit 1, resulting in quantum entanglement between the two. And in 
normally that would result in a probability of ket zero zero and ket one one at fifty uh, percent each approximately. But then on qubit one, I applied the Hadamard gate again for a superposition, and then went the opposite direction with the controlled knot gate for entanglement. And the result was very interesting because every probability, zero, 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 one, one, zero, and one, one, are all exactly 0.25. Now, normally the results will be approximately 0.25, but uh, carried out to six digits. In this result, I have exactly 0.25 on 00, 0 0.25 on 01, 0 0.25 on 10, 0 0.25 on 11. And this is even with my ground state, it's suboptimal because the ground state uh, indicator would be green. So, uh, very interesting result and uh, reflection of great accuracy of the quantum system. Perfect superposition, perfect entanglement.